Hello there. Welcome to Gadget Mad Lad. It has been a while. Uh, right, well, basically, cut straight to the case. Did I say it? Yeah, if I'm saying that right. <laughs> uh, basically, went into my local pawn shop recently and have a look about it like you do. And as I'm going out, I get see that one of the local, one of the salespeople chat me over. And he, he goes, Chris, I've got some for you if you want to take it. I was like, okay, what is it? So he gives me a box full of. DVDs and you know random PC games and stuff. So I was like, okay, cool. I'll take that back and have a look at it. So I got brought it back home, had a little look. There's a lot of crap and empty cases and stuff like that. But there was some genuinely good stuff. So I thought I'll put the best to one side and do a video about it. See what you all reckon. <laughs> so basically, we'll start with the DVDs. Nothing fantastic. There's not like great value or anything like. That. I mean, these are I think some like a couple of quid each or something. But it's the actual content on that content the actual you know stuff that it's about it seems quite interesting stuff so i've got this joecartoon.com this has got a poster inside it as well immaculate dvd i uh, checked it online it's only worth two pounds something but um that's not the point is it it's a collectible you know like um nostalgic value so i got that lord of the rings box set the special extended dvd edition so not blue or anything but nevertheless still great again you know what i mean look at, i'm saving the best for last us to you know as well so it does get better Let's move this out of the way. We've got Buffy the Vampire Slayer Season 1, Episodes 1 to 12, the Collector's Edition. This unfolds to like a big crucifix. <laughs> Pretty cool. Me and my missus are bit, quite big fans of Buffy and Angel, so this is a good find. I was like, ah, that's pretty cool. Uh, then, obviously, well, I've not actually seen this, believe it or not. This is, I'm, I'm like a uninitiated nerd or geek, whatever you call it. We've seen, um, what's it called? Oh, I forget the name of it. Serenity, yeah, that's the one. We've seen that a couple of times in the film, but this kept me to give this a go and c complete box set of DVD. You get me? You can't do that and that, can you? That's pretty cool. And obviously, I said the best DVD for last, or the best DVD box set for last, the Naked Gun trilogy. This is surely the best of all the DVDs. And don't call me Shirley, in case you get the joke, you know. Wah, 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 wah. Anyway, so that's the DVDs. So they're just sentimental value, shall we say. But then I got some games as well, which I thought was pretty cool. So first things first, I'll show you this. This is a for a PlayStation Two. It's like a DVD changer region thing about. With this, I can watch region uh, different region movies and stuff. If you ever try watching like a Japanese DVD on an English DVD player or an American DVD player, or whatever, you'll know what I'm talking about. It's, you get like a region error code kind of thing. Well, this enables you to bypass that and mod it in some way. I'm not too sure exactly how it works, but I thought that'll definitely come in handy. So, obviously, again, immaculate as well. So, not really any value there, but that was, again, probably a good part of the DVDs. But here's where the value starts. We got Lara Croft, Tomb Raider, Angel of Darkness. I did have the box. I'll put the... We'll go, we'll go through the, the value of it at the end, yeah, so we've got Sega Superstars, these are all immaculate condition bear in mind. The cases are a little bit right tatty but other than that they're really good. The, case, the, the discs themselves are in pretty fresh condition. Sega Superstars, uh, Rayman 3, uh, Metal Gear Solid, Sons of Liberty, Knight Rider 2 the game, and Beautiful Joe. Now that was basically... The games, now what we'll do, we'll go for the value of them. Right, so there's six games in total. I'll flash it on the screen and we'll go for what the prices are. The prices I'm going off are in the UK a CX or Sex. I'm not saying it with an S, I'm saying it with C, apparently, that's how they pronounce it. So, Metal Gear Solid Tons of Liberty sells in there for £3.50, which translates to $4.26, which translates to €3.96. Again, continuing with the prices from CX, translated into other currencies, we've got Beautiful Joe, which is one of the Dara games, which is £8 in the UK, which is $9.73, or €9.06. Euro and then third, we've got, ironically enough, Raymond Free, Hoodlum Havoc, and this one sells in CX for £3, which translates to $3.65, or €3.40. Euros Fourth in the list, we've got uh, Sega Superstars. 
which is not worth much, but it's still at the, it's a pound. So that's one dollar twenty two cents or uh, one euro thirteen. Fifth, we've got Lara Croft Tomb Raider: The Angel of Darkness. This one goes for two pound fifty, which translates to three dollars four cents or uh, two euros eighty three. Well, looking forward to giving us a place for this one. Sixth on the list is Knight Rider 2 The Game, or Knight Rider The Game 2, which we can all explain it's actually Knight Rider 2 The Game. They're a little bit illiterate with the punctuation or whatever there. <laughs> but this one is actually surprisingly worth £8 in the UK. Uh, it translates to $9.73, or €9 Euros and 6 which will now cut to the total. But wait, before we do, I have to put one thing to one side there. Uh, this was a, you know I was saying, uh, there were some empty DVD cases in there. This was something that came with the empty DVD cases. This is an empty DVD case. But I kept the sleeve because if you look there, you see where it says, all three movies, including an exclusive Stan Lee comic. Well, you'll never guess what was included in it. And it was the actual comic. I know you're probably thinking, wait a minute, what's this isn't worth anything. But surprisingly, I've checked this. Which I've put on the screen now. Holy crap! That's £24.95. That's not cheap. So that brings the grand total to £50.95, pence, which translates to $61.98 or €57.70. All for free. <laughs> Just because they like me at the chef, whatever. So that was a pretty good haul. Fine, wasn't it? <laughs> Plus I got loads of random FIFA games and some sports ones and some got a couple of DVDs that I put to one side for my dad. You know, like there's this uh, Eddie Murphy stand-up one, I think, as uh, Jack D or something. I said I think that had a disc in it, maybe. But I, there's some other stuff in there as well, but nevertheless, added value as well, you know, on top of that. So I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks for watching. And if I get given any more bags of mystery bags or anything, I'll be doing some of them again. So, bye.